there's a nice job there by Anthony Vega, the Ironbird center fielder, to get the ball back in play. Urban comes set, and now we'll deal with Rivero, who's going to send this into center field. Vega coming in, and we'll make the running grab. Here comes a throw home. Wins will field, and it is not in time. It's a sacrifice fly and an RBI for Rivero, and it's a one to nothing Cyclones lead. The one-two pitch with two down and a runner on third, and Richards has that go by get by him, and now Breen, or Vega rather is going to come in to score as the ball got by Playa. Oh, one delivery on the way. Fastball. Hector Willis sends this to Patrick Biondi in center field. He'll camp under it, and here comes Connor Bierfeld looking to score, or Trey Man Senior rather, and he will sacrifice five for Hector Willis. He does add to that RBI total. Now three to one in favor of the Ironbirds. 1-1 one, one pitch here with one out. Donnie Hart fires. Swung on in line. Hector Volos makes a diving play as the ball dro drops out of his glove. He flips to second base. What a play by Hector Volos. Tremendous play there as he fires over to second baseman Chris Richards to get Anthony Chavez hustling to second base. And here's the payoff pitch from Frias from the stretch. Swung on, driven to deep center field. Back goes Biondi. He's running back, 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 and he make, does not make the catch. It bounced out of his glove. As Jerry Breen is going to hustle to third base, he will be in with the triple. Austin Wins will come around to score. Four to one here. Ironbirds over the Cyclones. A one pitch here. Chris Richards drives this ball to right center field. In come both the outfielders. That ball will get down for a single. Chris Richards will have an RBI single on the play. Jerry Breen held up to make sure that ball did not fall into Right fielder James Roach's glove, but as it stands now, a 5-1 to one lead for the Ironbirds. It's going to be launched to left field. Back is Rust. He looks up, and it's a three-run homer for Brooklyn. And just like that, the Cyclones are back in the game. So Chavez with a home run to deep left center, and it's now a 5-4 to four Aberdeen lead. So we'll see what happens here. The 0-2 pitch to Mazzilli. I'd be surprised if you see anything close to the strike zone here from Figueroa. Here's the pitch. And this is going to be sent into left field. Rust coming in will make the catch. Tagging from third. Here's the throw. It is going to be in, not in time. And the Cyclones have tied the game. Two strike pitch to Rivero. is going to be grounded to second. Richards plays the tough hop barehanded and throws it on to first base. An incredible play from Chris Richards to get the final out of the top of the ninth. Playing the 1-1 one, one pitch is gonna be sent to third, threw it into the left field and coming around third, heading for home is Mazzilli. Here's the throw and he is out at the play! A terrific play from Tanner Rust in left field and now Mazzilli giving it to the home plate umpire, Rich Grassa, but Tanner Rust with a terrific play to end the top half of the 11th inning. The 1 0 pitch to Richards. He shows bunt and he bunts it. Fair ball down the third baseline and the ball goes, gets thrown into left field. And Jared Breen is going to walk off on an E3. And the Ironbirds are going to win their fifth in a row by a score of 6 to 5.